can you go watch some TV or something and turn that radio off? I'm sick of listening to it. Okay, well that was a success. Su success? That was a success? Look. <laughs> Dun dun dun! <laughs> oh, this is so scary! Hello, fellow humans, and welcome back to another episode. My name is Tash, and you're hanging out with me today while I play The Sims 4, and I'm incredibly frustrated because I've had technical difficulty after technical difficulty today. You guys have missed out on a bunch of stuff that I've done because it wasn't recording and it's a whole thing and I'm just really upset about life in general right now. So, uh, yeah. So, um, yeah, that's alright. Well, it seems to be recording now, so that's a thing. Let me catch you up. Scarlet, pregnant, now in second trimester because we've been playing the game. Third trimester in 11 hours. Gareth. We changed his job to a conservationist because that was a suggestion in the comments from the last episode. I really liked that idea and I thought that would work well for him so we've changed his career over. August has aged up. You guys missed his birthday. I did take screenshots of the gameplay as I was going through so I will include those at the end of this video from all of the stuff that you guys have missed plus whatever we do in this the rest of this episode august has grown up what we have done is and i will link these websites down below that if you're interested in using them but we randomly generated a trait james turner yt's random generator so we've used that and he got the traits assigned to him as follows lazy and he got assigned social butterfly so those are his uh, randomly generated traits. There is also a random trait generator on Sim Legacy Challenges. Hang on, let me. SimsLegacyChallenge.com. Like I said, I will link that below. We will use that to input Scarlet's traits and Manua's traits, and August will be randomly assigned one of his parents' traits. So we will use that when he changes into a teen, and then his second trait, like his final trait, will be randomly generated as well. So that is what we're going to do for that. We also had some baby name suggestions. Uh, Amelia for a girl, Casper for a boy. I love both of those so there's a good chance that I will end up using one of them for the new baby. Currently Scarlett has taken the day off work. She got real mad when she called in fake sick and they called her out on it so she took a vacation day. That was very entertaining. And it is Harvest Fest tomorrow. We just had August's birthday party. Well it wasn't a party. We made him a cake and whatever. So we did that. Tomorrow we've planned a dinner party. So we're going to have some people over for Harvest Fest dinner. We've decorated as well on the outside, which looks lovely. It's very nice, very nice. Apparently poor Scarlet is very pregnant and very exhausted. So I am so upset that I didn't realize that my Stream Deck record button wasn't working. I am, oh, I'm devastated. Oh, we did a makeover. A makeover time for for August so let's just have a quick look at what we did in cast for him all right so we have three outfits now because he got assigned randomly the lazy trait I wanted it to him to look like Scarlet has picked out his clothes but he kind of wears them in a sloppyish kind of way since that's kind of who he is as a person so we've got this outfit here his socks are actually knitted by Scarlet which I love all right then we have another outfit here and so then we've got this one here his tuxedo formal wear which I just think is adorable then we have a athletic number his favorite color is gray I randomly chose that just by closing my eyes and and clicking on whatever color I could first and we, we got gray so we also have his PJs some party wear with a pop of orange because I love it his swimwear his hot weather gear and his cold weather gear so he's looking very very cute we got him a bedroom um, set up using his favorite colors down there and we've converted this back into a nursery ready for the new baby when they come along and this is august's room here for now we don't have much money at all we literally have three simoleons so it's gonna have to wait until you know until we have some more money before we finish decorating but for now i think it's cute right we uh we also did a bunch of knitting let's put this over here for august to play with 
They are worth so much money. Look at that, that's 85 simoleons and 65. Jesus. Anyway, because we are so poor right now, we're hoping that we can sell some of Scarlet's knitting bits and pieces. Maybe we could have Gareth. Oh, great. What are you doing? Can you do some laundry? Oh, there's nothing in there. All right, can you do do a vacuum and then do laundry? Oh, search your pockets. That's money. No available. These clothes are already dry. And no available washing machine, excuse me. Oh, we got paid. Oh, that makes life easier. We'll be able to afford to cook a dinner now. Why is he sleeping right there? Do laundry. Right, so we don't have an available washing machine. That's great. Everything sucks. Can't upgrade while laundry is There's no laundry in there. Reset. All right, now let's see if that will work. Do laundry. No? Cool. There's no laundry inside, dude. What is... Oh my God. This game will be the death of me. No. Just stop, okay? Where is... How much are you? You're a thousand simoleons. How much are you? 420... 400. How much is it for it on its own? 500. I cannot believe this keeps happening. Do laundry. Add to washing machine. Please and thank you. If things could just go right for me for a change, that would be great. When she wakes up, she wants cake. She's not getting cake. She's going to repair. Did you start washing that? Wash laundry, please. Christ almighty. I'm so over today. Became friends with Gan Gar Gannett? Gareth Bennett. He's pretty cool. Listen, dude. I'm not in the mood for you right now, mate. All right, and we're gonna have her cooked in there because she's a better cook. That salad looks disgusting. I'm gonna throw it out. Sorry, Gareth, I know you tried. Maybe she can cook with, cook together with. They're gonna do some mum and son cooking. What are they gonna make? Maybe they can make gnocchi. What do you think you're doing? No, you're gonna spoil your dinner. Get out of it. Oh, cooking memories. Actually, let's have a look at what their sentiments are. For funsies. So they have a cooking together sentiment. I love that. And they're friends. And then what's his sentiments with, with Scarlet? Oh, he's smitten with her. Oh, I love that. And she's deeply in love with him. She doesn't have any sentiments with him. This is a solid relationship built on trust and great memory and son. And he doesn't have any about her. I think we need to fix that. All right, now what are you doing? Can you go watch some TV or something? And turn that radio off. I'm sick of listening to it. Are you going to cook together? Aww. That's so sweet. I wish they would cook next to each other though. She loves cooking. It's really nice that she can... Did he just drop that on his foot? It's like, no biggie. Ah! It's fine. It's fine. No big deal. Uh, it's just on my foot. I also gave him quite messy hair because I figured he'd just be too lazy to look after it. I wonder what the baby's going to be. I want a girl. I think it's going to be another boy. But I guess we'll see. Can you continue cooking? What are you doing? Ask for advice. No, we don't have time for that right now. We're cooking. We need to eat. Karen, no. I'm pregnant and I'm doing stuff with my family. Like you, You're always here. Why don't you just come over here? Can you go and... Please resume the butternut gnocchi. You stop trying to eat the cake. You're not having cake. They're making pasta for you. Put it, put it, put it down. Oh my God, Gareth. I said no cake. No cake for you. Put down the cake. All right. Witness to a bully. Some kids at school were being mean to one of my friends. Who haven't even been to school yet. I wanted to help, but I didn't know what to do. What do you think I should have done? Step in and stand up for your friend or stay out of it and console your friend. No, you stand up for your friend. Manners decrease. I don't care. Always stand up for your friends. All right, go and set the table. Let's do a casual. No, let's do a party burgundy because I think that would be nice. All right, you go set the table and then everyone can have dinner. If you go for cake again, I'm going to punch you. Oh, seriously, stop. There's pasta. Grab a serving. No, actually, you know what? Stop. You stop, you stop. Grab a serving. Pick up, grab a serving together. They're all in a group apparently. So everyone's gonna grab a seat. 
Can you not sit there? And can you all sit and eat together at the table? I'm so cranky. Let me know in the comments. Do you think we should change August to the more carroty orange uh, hair color that matches Scarlet's or have it be slightly different? So nice. They're eating as a family. I can't wait till the new baby arrives. I think it's time for everyone to go to bed, to be honest. Go sleep. And then I want you to tuck him in. Cooking memories. Oh, did she get a sentiment with him finally? Yeah, they got a cooking together sentiment. I love it. That vacuum cleaner is so noisy. Like, could you possibly... No, go down here. I want you to tuck him in. Become best friends? Can we tuck him in? No, I just... All right, well, apparently she can't tuck him in. Whatever. I don't care anyway. I didn't even want to. Unload and hang on clothesline. He's gonna go hang that out and then he can search pockets and then do laundry. All right, he's going to do that. Found a whole nine dollars and then he can go to bed. Then tomorrow they're gonna cook for Harvest Fest. They're gonna have a fun time. I'll have her probably rummage for some decorations that we can use as well. And then the baby should arrive soon. Still three hours until her third trimester, so it should be okay. We should be able to get in. We should be able to get in and out to Harvest Fest dinner. I want her to go and she okay, so she needs to have a shower. No, not you. You need to rummage for fall decorations. I need you to please. What are you doing? And to dry. No, 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 so expensive. All right, you can have that in your inventory for now. I want August to uh, set the table with fancy dots. He's eating cake again. All right, you can't do that there, so that's fine. Let's rummage for decorations. Third trimester realness. The stomach size of a sim doesn't have anything to do with how many babies they're having. It has to do with their physique, I think, and how fit they are. But gee, she's so much bigger than she was with August, I feel. Alright, you can do the holiday gnomes. Appease the gnome, give him a toy. No, don't leave! Rude. Where did they go? Oh, down here. Appease the gnome, give him coffee, give him pie. Alright, what do we have here? Let's just take some of the stuff that we have. We're decorating for Thanksgiving or Harvest Fest, whichever you would like to call it. Hey, 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 hey. No, no. No tempura for you. I wish people would stop trying to take food when Scarlet is cooking them things. Maybe just a rustic brown colour. That's cute. Okay. If you, are you putting that food down? You, I told you no tempura for you. Stop. Yes, let's start. Dinner party time. Oh my god, stop it! You're not having any tempura! I hate you so much. You, why are you not chained? Right, this dress looks bad with her pregnant belly. I'm gonna see if I can find her something else quickly. How's he going with those? Why is only one person shown up for dinner? Oh, is this them? Yeah, okay, cool. People are coming and then we can have dinner. Right, how are you going with these gnomes? Are you appeasing them well or...? Alright, that one's good. If you do not go for that tempura, I swear to god, August, sit. I said no! Oh no! Oh god. Everything's going wrong! Repair, repair! Get out. You can stay. Appease the gnome. We'll give you a toy. Because I think you'd like that. Chat with Akira. It's fine. It's fine. Wait, what? No, what was that? I missed it! Something about him being dastardly? You, quickly mop this up. I know you're very pregnant, but just do it. And then we're going to call everyone to a grand meal. And it's going to be wonderful. I don't know what he... Jesus. All right, everyone, time for dinner. Ruby land crab. She needs a makeover. I'm not doing any more makeovers though. I already did one for August and no one got to see it because 
nothing was recording and everything is bad and I just don't have it in me to do another makeover right now. I love this dress. You look so good. That's so cute. Hey Kira, my love. Looking very suave. Poor Scarlet looks miserable. Gareth looks happy. Wait, is Luna? Luna's pregnant. Everyone seems to be loving it. And can I just... <laughs> oh my God, Scarlet, I love you so much. This is like the actual best. Everyone seems to be having a great time. Why does he look so cranky? Those jealous traits are not cool. He needs to chill the F out. Looks like Akira's jimming the camera. I love that thing. I thought I told you to get out. Alright, I'm putting it in the fridge, but if anyone wants leftovers. No, you're full. You can stop you can stop eating now. You've had enough. Aw, oh, look at that enjoy company. Oh, she can ask him to be flower pal. Wait, ask him to be ring bearer at wedding. Hey, buddy. <laughs> the, the sass. The sass. Oh my god, I love it so much. I love that everyone's just over there watching TV, hanging out. This is such a nice gathering. I cannot with that face. It's like, mum, please. Akira, get out of my shot. <laughs> She has the best expressions! Oh, I love them so much. They're watching a zombie movie. There's a child here! You guys have zero chill. Make a pie. Pumpkin pie. Cook. I wish there was a search function. It would be so useful. We have so many recipes now. I think it was closer to the end. Pumpkin pie. Yeah. What are you doing? He's feeling playful, so he's gonna go play in the laundry for reasons. I would rather it if you cleaned up all the dirty dishes. You know, help out your fiance. Look how pregnant she is. She's been cooking all day, and you want her to clean up as well? Stop talking and make the pie. <laughs> it's floating dough. I love how pleased with herself she looks. Yeah. Bake that pie. Are you cleaning up or what? No, of course you're not. Why would you clean up? And then we'll call everyone to pie. Can you go clean up the dishes? The dinner party's almost over, but hopefully pie should be a nice finishing touch. All right, everyone come get some pie. And then she's going to bed. And we got paid. So we can decorate the baby's rooms, the kid's room. She's like, oh, bitches, I'm out. I don't know if we should get to keep the money from this stuff, but I'm gonna do it. And then you guys let me know if we should not do that and then next time I won't. But for now, I'm not mad at the extra money. Okay, Gareth, this is an argument I have with my husband all the time. When I ask you to clean up, the kitchen table is included in the kitchen, okay? She's just going straight to bed. Everyone else can entertain them. Did everyone get their pie? He mustn't want to. Oh, it's all gone. Okay, well that was a success. Su success? That was a success? Alright, everyone's leaving. Thankful spirit. He loves this tradition. Looks like he's having a pretty good... They're all having a pretty good Thanksgiving. What is she gonna do? What about you? I'm being a child. Holiday gnomes. So can you do stuff with the gnomes, can you, buddy? Plead for forgiveness. I don't think I asked for you to vacuum down here. Pretty sure I asked you to vacuum upstairs. I'm gonna let her sleep just for a little bit longer. I just want them all to get finish off these holidays so that way when the baby comes they're gonna be in really good mood. Uh, I didn't ask you to do that. I asked you to go and plead for forgiveness. <laughs> you are your mother's child. Yeah! Well done! And then I want you to wake her up. You can both complete the thankful spirit or do you just do that on your own get up she's like oh my god <laughs> he's like get up and she's like this is disgusting so mad at him what do you want you do not he looks so scared you don't wake up a pregnant lady when she's sleeping okay now you guys have to be thankful together and then she's going back to sleep what do you think you're doing? Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. No, no. 
You don't. You woke her up. You don't get to go anywhere. Oh, yeah, Moosh Peps no. And she also needs to give give some respect. All right, don't worry about that. No, we're done with that. We're done with that. I want you to go down here. Maybe we'll give him a name. Fluffers. We're gonna name them all. What are you gonna call him? Creepy Joe, because he's naked. And then we'll call you Creepy Larry. Give respect and gifts to the friendly gnomes and hopes of festive rewards. Well, she can't do that now. Maybe I'm just gonna have her kick it. She's looking at them. It's almost the end of Harvest Fest. It's fine. We're just gonna kick it. It's like, I don't like you. You're creepy. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh god. I wonder if this could be our thumbnail. Perfect. Look! <laughs> oh my god, I love you so much! <laughs> oh my god! She's mad, mad, I say! Fine, we're going to bed. Shh, she's just gonna go to sleep. It's fine. Shh. He has no idea what's going on. He comes downstairs and there's like a bunch of very angry gnomes and everything is rubbish everywhere. It's fine. Listen, so angry. All of them. There's so many angry gnomes now. No, don't do that. You can't go to bed yet. You have to wash the laundry first, clean the lint tray, then you can go to bed. Actually, throw away all the stuff too. Ooh, we got a, f a, a gem of some description. Throw away the rubbish. They're real mad. They're real, real mad. Are you ready for to go now? Oh my god. Oh my god. They're coming for her. Dun dun. Dun. <laughs> oh. She turns over and this is what she sees. <laughs> Fine, nothing to worry about here. Oh my god, they're getting closer. Oh, this is so scary! She's in big trouble now. <laughs> they're here. I love that Gareth just isn't paying any attention to them. He's like, I don't want to know what she did, I don't care. Ah! Looks like he has a gun. This is horrifying. Why did we do this? It's almost time for them to leave. It's fine. It's fine. We're about to have a baby, okay? This is not cool. 159. Harvest first successful. Yay! Very little in the way of consequences for her. Which is what she's all about. Although everything up here is broken, so that's wonderful. And she is going to wake up just to see these guys all surrounding her bed. And I hope that makes her think next time about kicking the gnome because clearly terrifying things happen. Ah, she's in labor! Scarlet is in labor! Scarlet is in labor! And there's just gnomes everywhere. This is fine. She's like, can you calm down? And she's just like, yeah, I'm fine. This is. No, you're not having any cake right now. You need to repair the toilet. What do you think you're doing? Repair. I know you're tired, but also too bad. Mop up all the water, please. And then she's going to go to the hospital. You don't have time to eat. You're going to have a baby. But you do have time to fix the toilet, so... No, don't worry about that. Oh my god. Alright, we're going to go to the hospital. We're going to the hospital, okay? Have a baby at hospital. Oh, I wish I could bring the kid. It would be so nice for August to be able to be there. Alright, it's baby time! This is it. It's four in the morning. She looks very calm, even though it's raining. Also, can we talk about how Gareth is all like umbrellaing himself from the rain? But poor Scarlet, she's just being rained on. That's very rude, Gareth. I'm disappointed in you. Aw, he's giving her the most beautiful look and she's like, don't even talk to me, this is all your fault. <laughs> <laughs> that 
that's a look. She's in so much pain right now and he just took off. Garrus, I am less than impressed with your attitude, mister. Oh, thank God it's not um, Miho. You seem much nicer than the last she delivered our baby. So thank you for that. She's an intern? Oh, what's happening? I wonder if that tea posing glitch is gonna happen again. Alright, what is it? She's playing a game. <laughs> it's a girl! <laughs> oh, it's a girl! I'm so excited! August and Amelia. I love that we have a little girl! Oh, I'm so excited! Alright, um, what's Gareth's name? Gareth. What's his last name? Right, it'll just be Reeves for the minute. We'll just have to. <gasps> pose lovely we love to see it Gareth Bennett okay so it'll be Bennett Reeves so I'll have to change their names oh it's time to go home with our twins we have twins oh my god we have twins all right we need to get a second we were not expecting tw where's the other baby there's Amelia where's Casper Casper's in here oh I kind of want them to be in the same bassinets though so we're gonna can you, can we not change? All right, they're not gonna be in the same bassinet. Oh, she's gonna be so busy. Change dirty diaper. Feed, there we go. Oh God, this is gonna be exhausting. All right, can you go and bottle feed him? No, I want you, can you guys stop? Go here, this is like infuriating. You go here. All right, now you go and breastfeed and then you can bottle feed. All right, well, let's deal with this obnoxious noise. Here we go. I am so excited to have two babies. I can't believe we had twins. That's so exciting. I'm actually going to leave this episode here, guys, because I think I've been recording for so long. I'm going to finish up the episode here. I think it's been a really fun one, actually. It's a pity that you guys didn't get to see August's birthday party, but I'll put screenshots up of like what happened in that first hour of gameplay that you guys missed <sighs> and then next episode i think we can start focusing on getting these little guys into being toddlers and planning the wedding for scarlet and for gareth little casper and little august i think they're such a sweet little family i love them so much so with all of that don't forget to like this video if you did indeed like it don't forget to subscribe if you haven't yet because you know I would love to see you back here again and leave me feedback let me know do you like the names did you think it would be twins are you excited are you enjoying it do you think August is cute what do we want to do for the wedding I was thinking a backyard wedding where they sort of planned it themselves so it'll be a, bit, a little bit more low-key I thought that could be a fun way to go but let me know your thoughts and what you think we should do Thank you all so much for hanging out with me today while I played The Sims 4. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Okay, bye!